I've given myself one minute to answer this complex question. Did the Zulus have guns or was the war simply a case of modern European weapons versus shields and spears? Let's find out. From the 1830s, the Zulus made an effort to get their hands on as many firearms as possible, mainly through trade with European hunters. It's thought that around 20,000 firearms were present in Zululand at the time of the British invasion in 1879, but only around 500 of those were said to be modern breech loaders. The rest were mainly outdated muzzle loading muskets. The quality of powder and bullets was also poor. But at Isandwana, after their victory, the Zulus captured a thousand modern Martini Henry rifles and plenty of ammunition. This meant that at later battles such as Kambula, the Zulus were well armed, but the problem was that they had little knowledge of musketry and would usually set the sights incorrectly and fire well over the heads of the British. So to sum up, the answer is that yes, they had firearms. Okay guys, there you have it. And in a flash, I've grown my hair, I've lost my braces, looking much better, plus my voice has gone. Just a quick one at the end of that video, I wanted to update, if you don't know about the Clash of Empires exhibition that's taking place in London in July, check it out. Go to clashofempires.org. It's being organised by Ian Knight, the preeminent historian of the Anglo-Zulu War. Thousands of artefacts on show, loads to see, and loads of speakers are going to be there, including the likes of John LeBand, Cam Simpson, both of whom have been on this show, and loads, loads more. I'm also going, I'm going to be there interviewing most of the guys who are, and girls who are taking part. It's going to be really interesting. And on the last Saturday, Saturday the 15th, I'm going to have a bit of a meetup at the Royal Philatelic Society. The details may change. But if you sign up for my mailing list over at redcoathistory.com, I'll send you an email of all the information. In the meantime, if you want to go to the conference, then get your tickets. Go to clashofempires.org. It's going to be fantastic. I'm even thinking of making some t-shirts that I can give out to like the first 10 people who, who come to the meetup. So please do keep in touch. All right, guys, hopefully I'll see you in July.